Okay, so let's talk about network on Instagram now. This is not some overly used method or I think a lot of people are not just getting the basics. Let me hurry and delete that image section of this. But really, okay, now let me just check recent followers, right? So we're gonna go here and we're gonna check out this person and see what they're all about, wine lover. So it looks like she's a business person. So as I said on the blog post, if you haven't read the blog post, okay, so she has an opt-in. So I don't, it says get direct access to a copy and paste market system designed to make new money and, and get free wine too. Okay. So we just message her. Let me go. Hey. Hey, Angela, thank you for the follow. I see that you created an opt-in for your wine business. Just look in to network my name is paul by the way so and it's hit send i mean really it's really like that so let's see now we can go back and we can go to recent followers and let's check out this so nope so we have this guy, a uh, musician, he doesn't have a link. Uh, so really what you're just looking for are people that have links. You can check out their website, um, download and subscribe. So it's, let's see what she's all about. Uh, probably her podcast, um, probably considering favorites, featured episode, download your guide for family meetings, a blog. Eh can't really see me networking with her uh, real estate uh, we buy property homes right okay now just realize not everyone is going to answer not everyone is going to respond to you and just be like hey uh, hold on let me see who's got a name no he ain't got a name okay so you say Hey, just seen that you followed me, follow me back, just, just come in into your, your DM to say thanks. Okay, so there is a numerous amount of different strategies you can pop to use. Let's see what she's binary. Eh. A lot of these people like to pitch you as soon as you contact them, and I'm not looking to get blogger. Um, it could be like anything as a blogger. Uh, so it looks like open Spotify, Dutch. Oh, I know she don't. Um, and what you really want to do is you just want to check your recent followers, see if they have a website and all that good jazzy stuff. Um, got freaking weird accounts following me too. Uh, nope. Um, let's see about these guys. Okay. So we can follow them back, message them, uh, what is name? Bianca, just, oops, just seen you followed me and gave you a follow. Back. 
see that your see that your in oop your as I said I'm 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 doing this right now so your in the fitness niche or niche however you want to say it and then you just hit and then fitness niche let's do an extra one how how are you doing oh, oh, how are you doing this amazing Sunday <laughs> well at least Sunday, where, where I'm from. But really, that's it. I mean, it's it's really just about being friendly. So you you don't have to be like throw these crazy messages, right? Be like, hey, buy my shit or opt into my shit. And what what you do, you you would talk to them. <clears throat> and um, I don't have an example. I probably do somewhere somewhere in all. My people I message so I would have to look for about 20 minutes because it just goes on and on and on and on but what you could do is you could literally just go through all these messages um, so usually I'll talk to them for about two or three days be before I even send them a pitch, I'm not even a pitch, a, a blog post, which usually is growing your followers, which is usually a growth, um, which I use. I'll use that, or I'll use. I just use my straight opt-in. But be before I send them to an opt-in, I would actually send them to a blog post, which a blog post has as soon as you get on there is an opt-in, so it gives them an option if they want if they want to learn more after they have already read the blog post. But anyways. That's really about it. I mean, it, it's not a complicated network. You just, it's got to be friendly. You got to be real. You got to be authentic when you're when you're actually sending people DMs and don't be a spammer. And just in the end, it's about giving these people value. Whatever you're doing, if you're in real estate, if you're uh, doing wine or whatever you're doing, you you need end of the day. You need to give them value, and it's, it's something they need to be interested in. So. Um, and it, so at the end of the conversation, um, after a day or two, or even w within the first conversation, depending on how long the conversation goes, I'd be like, if you're interested, um, I, I have a blog post that talks about growing your followers. If, if you're interested in, in reading that blog post and they say yes or no, then you send them a link and it's really that simple. Um, so anyways, let's get out of here. Uh, kids and them are at the store, give me enough time to do this little short video. And we'll definitely be doing more. So if you haven't opted in or you haven't checked out my blog post, I have all the info down below. But other than that, it's just a simple couple steps you need to take with networking on, <clears throat> on Instagram through the direct message. Other than that, that is how to network on Instagram easily and properly without looking like a spammer. All right, everyone. Oh, don't forget to subscribe and like and comment. <laughs>